Hello people, we're on the road. We're just on the other side of Kansas City. And we're getting ready to go see my mom. We're driving in a nice car. With a tailgater. And here's Willie. Say hi Willie. Hello. Hello. Yeah. But yeah, so this is the start of everything. I'm gonna be taking pictures of him once we get into Colorado. Uh, right now it's overcast, but I think we'll be coming out of it by the time we get halfway through Kansas. Ooh, there was a nice little quick lane change. Yeah, now we're getting up into the heart of it, but I just wanted to take a minute and get this thing started up. We're going to be in the hotel tonight about 8.30ish. So wish us luck, and I'll talk to you later. Bye. Hey guys, we are in Central central to the central western part of Kansas and what you're seeing now is a shit ton of solar or wind uh, turbines lots of them my friend goes I wonder how many is out here I said probably at least 300 he goes oh there's way more and there's there he is I mean, and this is like, guys, we are here in the flat part of Kansas. You know what I mean? So this is, this is an experience. We were just at a, a, a little area where my buddy here had to stop and stretch his legs. And we were standing out in the parking lot and I thought I was going to get blowed down and stuff. But yeah, it's so cool to see this, you know. Missouri and Texas have a lot of uh, turbines, but out here on the wind swept waste of Kansas, they got a shit ton too, so I think that's pretty cool. But uh, yeah, I'll pull the camera back out here a little bit later on this afternoon when we pull into Cal into Colorado. But yeah, this is pretty cool. We need to get these down. Yeah, some of them it takes a little while for them to you know. I tell you what, the guys that maintain those those things up there, they make some hell of money. It's like that's a career that's something that you can like all these poor people that are getting out of their uh, coal mining jobs and stuff put them out here building renewable stuff hell yeah jobs forever but anyway I just wanted to show you guys this catch you later for the next stuff hey guys here we are out in Kansas we are about 350 miles from Fort Collins and I'm showing you this video there's this big white cloud deck that's over here in front of us and if you look close once we get past some of these trees here you can see that there's rain coming out from underneath some of that over to the roadside where we're at it's just clear as a bell and we're doing pretty good making good time we should be there about 7 30 get everything in the room relax a little bit turn on the TV pass the fuck out later but yeah it's it's very flat country out here but in certain ways with seeing all of the like uh, you know the oil wells and all that stuff it's pretty crazy out here it's very wild this you know central part of, of America so but once we start getting into Colorado, it's going to get a lot prettier. So I will bring out the camera again then. So see you guys later. Hey guys, we are here in Western Kansas, about ready to cross over into Colorado here just a little bit. But uh, if you look out this side of the window, there's this big giant cloud complex right here in front of us with that, those clouds. And, and, and Willie's checking right now and seeing there's no rain forecasted and so stuff guys, no it's not showing on the map oh, okay yeah it's not showing on their map yes car go on through but uh yeah getting to see that western kansas weather i want to see what it's going to be like whenever we get into colorado proper yeah colby's going to be coming up here pretty soon but yep so we went through a lot of sunshine now it's kind of starting to get overcast we may go through a little bit of something, but we'll see how that goes. But uh, anyway, I will pop this out again when we get into uh, Colorado.
Isn't that crazy looking though, guys? Look at that, man. That is nuts. That's scary business right there. Here's why. Hey guys, we're in western Colorado coming into a humongous storm thing. We had a little bit of rain already. And if you see off to the left of us here, you see these uh, 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 wind turbines? These suckers are earning their paycheck. This is the fastest we've seen any of them turning on our journey so far. And they're wicked. Look at how dark that is. So I, I, I'm going to have fun editing all of this together and making the tra travel vlog for when I put it on my channel. But yeah, this is the weather in the western United States, man. Like Willie said, this is a bread basket. But the bread basket is going about to get wet. If it looks like that's any indication. These are the kind of... T of tornado clouds that you could see at Transformers. I can see, what's the car that's the, the, the Camaro with the, is he Bumblebee? I can see Bumblebee flying out of that. But yeah, this look, I mean, you know, you don't want to be out here if it hits 75 miles an hour wind, because that'll blow most of these cars off the road and stuff, but, you know, you definitely don't want to, uh, you know, you got to be very careful. Wow. All right. Well, we'll check back here a little bit. I just want to show you this crazy wall of, of uh, clouds. Say hi, Willie. Uh, yeah, he's tired, but we've been driving all day. But yeah, we're officially in Colorado now and everything. And we're driving through a little bit of rain, a little bit of drippy drops. We've had some heavier rain pours and shit like that. We just stopped just a minute ago, a little while back, stretch his legs and stuff like that because he's a big guy. And driving in this car, it's kind of, the seats are kind of wonky. But yeah, we just got a few more hours and we'll be in Fort Collins. And uh, soon we'll be, tomorrow I'll get to see mom and take some pictures and see what the Aspens look like and all that shit. Go back to Kansas because of the roads. <laughs> he, says, he says the roads in Colorado are horrible. Well, it's like, you know, like I said, these roads were built in like the 30s, 40s, and 50s and stuff. And, you know, yeah, they've been worked on over the years, but they're never going to be perfect because you're like out here in corn country and stuff, you know. All the good roads and crap go in out of uh, Colorado Springs, Loveland, Greeley, Fort Collins, towns like that stuff. But we'll be in Fort Collins. I'll take pictures of the outside of the hotel when we get there and stuff. I got to check in and then we'll carry all our crap into the room and relax. And tomorrow when we get up, we get continental breakfast. So I will cut this off and we will be back later on. But look at that, guys. Isn't that nuts? Those cow clouds are crazy. Willie said he wants to go back to Kansas. Uh, no, no, no. That defeats the purpose of why we're doing this. But, yeah. At least the car is up to the task and it's getting pretty good gas mileage. So, I guess we can't complain. So, later. Bye. Hey, guys. We are here. Hope the camera will adjust. We are get, about to get about an hour and a half or so we're going to be in the Fort Collins but uh yeah we're out here and the clouds are kind of like overhanging and all this you can see and stuff but it's like this is just like beautiful there's like a mist hanging out kind of over the the fields and stuff through here we got vehicles in front of us but yeah this is pretty cool it's pretty out here that's why it's called picturesque What's that guy that did all Frank? No, who's that did the Saturday Evening Post pictures? Can't think of that guy's name, but he's a very famous artist. Ansel Adams, I think. Norm Rockwell. Norman Rockwell. Yeah, this is Norman Rockwell right here, dude. For real, this is beautiful. Yeah, we're still driving to various uh, 
raininess is and things and stuff so but yeah when I see something cool like this guys I'll uh, keep pulling stuff out so ah well he's getting his camera out taking pictures and a little quickness so I'll see you we'll take we'll take pictures in the hotel room when we get there later good morning strange people me and Willie have just recently woken up eating a less than continental breakfast get, getting his bed fixed because the frames broke and uh, we're headed from Fort Collins to uh, Loveland to go see my dear mama and just do our thing for the next few days and who knows if Willie gets the deck Nicholson up in his hackles on Monday when we leave we might go uh, fuck off and go to Cheyenne for breakfast before we head out of this son of a bitch we don't know it's up to him so anyway there'll be more pictures and more stuff done over time just let you know we're heading out so see y'all later bye those right there in the background let's see if I can get this thing to zoom in any okay hold on right about there we'll get past some of these trees but off in the distance if we can get past all of this there we go a little bit but yeah if you look off in that direction there's some beautiful snow-capped mountains part of the Rocky Mountain range and I'll be taking some really cool video going up towards Estes and there's some really cool places I'll show you that river that goes all over the highway it's a trip and yeah so you gotta admit I mean I don't know what place that you may personally live but for us being in the Midwest this is a treat because we don't got mountains like this down around Springfield so see you later all right guys well here we are at the hotel just testing this thing out and uh, yeah, we're getting ready to go to Estes here in a little while. But anyway, just wanted to test the camera. Here's our room. Oh boy. Woo. Back to the outside. All right, guys. Later. Bye. Good morning, folks. I'm here with my mom and Willie, and we're going up to Estes. What do you think of this so far, Willie? Uh, he gives the chuckle of approval. What do you think of this, Mom, since you've been here so many times? I love it. Mom loves it. So there you go. And we're looking, and I'll show you these rock outcroppings and stuff. And when I when we get up to the stoplight next to the uh, to the uh, overlook, I'll take a little shot right there. But yeah, we're taking our time going up there, and, and I'll do some more video and some pictures later. But you know, this is it. This is going up to Estes Park, Colorado.